Now we got our model populated with the data. Let's use this data to render on the UI. So I'm going to paste some code here inside search.html as this is long HTML. So you can see I'm looping through all the cities we have loaded using find function of the service. First, I'm showing the image for the weather, then the city name and country, then country image, weather description and some other info like current temperature, minimum temperature, maximum temperature, so on and so forth. And finally, geo coordinates of the city. Let's run the application, enter some city name and there we go. We got our data painted on the browser. But it seems we got a problem here. We are not getting the images rendered and this temperature seems to be not in degrees, right? And it seems we are having some problem with our view as well. So we need some CSS as well. So let's assign some CSS class here and write that CSS class in custom.css file. Then I'm gonna fix the images first. Let's go and check on open weather map search functionality. Let's do the same search. Here we got the results. Let me check the image URL by copying and pasting in the new window. Okay, so I think we are not getting the full image URL here. Let's check that. So I'm going to lock the cities. Check the icon property value. Get that. We are not getting the complete URL. So we need to form the URL using this URL. So I'm going to prepend this value with fully qualified path and append it with PNG. I mean ping extension. Let's refresh, search and you can see it's working fine now. Next we got a problem with country image. So I'm going to fix this as well. Remember to use true lowercase function here as this image icon is in uppercase. And this temperature seems to be in Kelvin value. So let's subtract some value from this value and format it with a number filter. Let's do the same at other places as well. Let's refresh and search. Cool, seems fine now. So you can see I have made the city name and geo cards as links. So when the user will click on this, we should navigate to the detailed weather. So first, we need to load the detailed weather data for the selected city and let's do that next. 